In this exercise, you will learn how to determine the efficiency of the given three-phase induction motor by no-load and blocked rotor test. Observe the nameplate details of the given three-phase induction motor and tabulate it in the table shown above. Make the connections to the motor as per the circuit shown above. Ensure that the auto transformer is kept at minimum position and the motor is not mechanically loaded. Close the TPST switch and switch on the power supply. The motor starts rotating slowly. Adjust the auto transformer to run the motor at rated speed. Note down the readings of no load magnetizing current I1 and watt meters readings W1 and W2 in the table 1. Adjust the auto transformer to minimum position. Switch off the power supply and open the TPST switch. Then remove all the connections. Supply a DC voltage of 30 volts to the stator windings. Note down the readings of voltage V, current I for the corresponding position in Table 2. Calculate the resistance of the winding using Ohm's law V equals IR. Calculate the resistance per phase RP with resistance R using the above relation. Calculate the effective AC resistance by using the formula shown above. Calculate the constant loss by using the formula shown above. I1 is no load magnetizing current I1 in amps from table 1. Rs is stator resistance per phase. Make the connections to the motor as per the circuit shown above. Connect the brake drum and tighten the belt fully. Keep the auto transformer in minimum voltage position. Close the TPST switch and switch on the power supply. Increase the auto transformer output voltage to get the full load rated current. Note down the values of rated full load current IFL, voltmeter reading VFL, and wattmeter reading W1 and W2 in Table 3. Adjust the auto transformer to minimum position. Switch off the power supply and open the TPST switch. The equivalent circuit diagram of three-phase induction motor is shown above. The equivalent circuit parameters are conductance G1 in MO, admittance Y1 in MO, acceptance BM in MO, total resistance per phase RT, total leakage reactance per phase XT, equivalent load resistance RL1, no load input current per phase I0 pH, and equivalent rotor current per phase I2 pH1. Calculate the values of equivalent circuit parameters of conductance G1, admittance Y1, and acceptance BM. Calculate the values of total resistance per phase RT and total impedance per phase ZT. Calculate the value of total leakage reactance per phase XT. Calculate the value of equivalent load resistance RL1. Calculate the values of no load input current per phase and equivalent rotor current per phase. Calculate the value of stator current per phase. Calculate the input complex power SI where SI equals PI plus JQI. Calculate the efficiency of the motor by using the formula shown above. Thus, you have understood how to determine the efficiency of the given three-phase induction motor by no-load and blocked rotor test.